Hi everybody, it's David Hope here and I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about how log files get ingested into Elastic. And uh, we, we talked about one way you could do that in a previous video, which was using Logstash. But I also wanted to show you how you can do this with the Open Telemetry Collector. Now, I honestly believe that at some point in the future, the Open Telemetry Collector is going to become the de facto way to collect all your logs, metrics, traces, and even profiling data. So we're going to come into the Open Telemetry Collector and you'll be able to do some normalization and enrichment via the Open Telemetry Collector. So once you've done that, it'll mean that you already have one place to collect all that data instead of having like a million different agents to install. Uh, so in the future, at some point, I think this will become the de facto way to get all that data, all that telemetry, all that observability data, and even business data as well, into your chosen observability tool. In this case, we're gonna be using Elastic. So let's just talk a little bit about how we do that. So I've got over here a Linux environment, you can see my multi-cloud environment. And first of all, we just download the Open Telemetry Collector. In this case, I've decided to go with the Contrib distribution of that because that contains things like the file log appender which is uh, file log receiver sorry which is quite useful to be able to ingest uh, log files from the file system so we get the contrib installation uh, distribution and then we install that with the uh, with the standard dpkg command right so once we've done that we then can go and find our configuration file which is in except and then you'll see Otel Contrib. And if we have a little look in here, you can see I've got a configuration file. And if we take a little look at that, you can see that what we're doing is we're getting data from the syslog address here. So syslog data will essentially get sent into this address. I'll show you how to configure that as well. And then our open telemetry collector will collect syslog data uh, it'll put the uh, the body of the message into the right place. Uh, it'll put it from uh, attributes message into into the body, and uh, we are then sending that over to Elastic here using the OTLP configuration that you can see. And then down here in the pipeline, we've configured it to go from the syslog receiver through a batch processor which you could do some more normalization and enrichment in if you wanted to. And then we export it to the Elastic endpoint over here. So it's a pretty simple configuration file. We've got, as I said, the syslog receiver, which is listening on port 54527. We then take that information, send it through the batch processor, and then over to Elastic. You can go to my GitHub repository, which is linked below and you can go and check out this configuration file. So once you've configured the uh, OTEL collector to receive data from syslog, you can actually essentially go and configure the R syslog, the R syslog uh, configuration, right? Oh, it's not a directory, that's correct. So in the bottom of here, you can see we're using a template and then we're getting all the syslog data and sending it over here to port 54527. So the open telemetry collector will then receive that data and send it to Elastic. Very, very simple. As I said, I've got these examples in the GitHub repository below, so you can go and check it out. And what does that look like in Elastic? Well, if you have a look in Elastic over here, you can see that my log data is coming in from the syslog. And if you look in here, you click on stream, you can see, you know, the last hour of data that's come in. Looks like somebody called Noob is trying to connect to my Linux box. And Dan, this looks like hacking attempts. So we probably want to do something about that. Yeah, somebody is trying to log in from root. So like, I mean, we're obviously getting some some hacking attempts onto my box here. So this is useful information. And you could also send this to the security part of Elastic as well, right? So uh, you can get some information uh, into, into security as well. 
So yeah, I mean, now we've got all this lovely syslog data in Elastic and it was very, very easy to set that up. As I said, you just install the uh, open telemetry collector, set up the rsyslog config, config to send data to the open telemetry collector. The open telemetry connector collector connects to Elastic, sends the log data in there. All very easy for you to do. So that's it really, that's, that's how easy it is. And like I said, it should be also very easy to do normalization and enrichment with that as well using uh, the pipeline as defined in the open telemetry collector configuration. Thanks very much everybody, bye bye.